Good morning, my plus ones. Hope everybody's doing well. Today is Wednesday, hump day. I'm going to talk about my nonna, my mom, and, you know, parents and grandparents. They teach you many powerful lessons in life, whether it be just in their example and the way they live their lives and and the things that they do for you as their family um, or, you know, verbal things that they teach you that, you know, might have some humor in it, but also have relevance um, to even today. And so it, it definitely contributes to building you as the person that you're aiming to be. Um, it, it could definitely be a goal to be more like them and have more success in your life um, and, and different aspects for sure. Um, so the, the thing that I'm going to bring up today as the topic of the day is going to be consistency because there's a lot of power in being able to always show kindness and tenderness towards people in general, let alone your family member, despite what's thrown at you. Because sometimes um, people could have the tendency, and not not everybody is like this, obviously, everybody is built differently, um, but sometimes people could have the tendency of being rough towards others because that's what was given towards them. Um, being um, hostile, I guess, a little bit because of irritability. Maybe, um, you know, you wake up happy, um, so you're going to treat others good. But for some reason, one day you wake up and you're just in a stank, at, you know, mood. Are you going to be nasty towards the people around you? Even though they didn't say anything or do anything hurtful towards you. Um, some people do, unfortunately. Or are you going to be happy despite um, others talking, you know, nasty to you? And then, or, or, you know, you're at work and your boss is harping on you and giving you you know, a, a bunch of unreasonableness. Are you going to go home and divorce your wife? I mean, I hope not. You know, that, that wouldn't make a whole lot of sense. So the the thing that I've learned a lot from my Nona, and my mom does this too, is whatever happens outside of the home, they never brought it home. In other words, if, if people are doing you dirty outside... It has nothing to do with your family. So there's no reason to be stank towards your family. So I try my very best to not... I mean, maybe I was in the past, obviously, you know, immaturity and things like that. But as you mature and as you grow older, you realize that, you know, yeah, emotions could be very powerful. But a mindset could be stronger than emotions. So if somebody does or says something to me I if I'm upset or I'm going to show any kind of hostility it's going to be towards the person who said or did something nasty to me if you're good to me almost every day you wake up and you speak kindly and you speak softly what reason do I have to be aggressive towards you or upset with you so that consistency that's where it lies is despite how I feel, if I wake up in the morning and I'm happy, I'm going to be happy toward you. If I wake up in the morning and I'm feeling stank, if you've always been good to me, why am I going to be stank to you? Or if it was that day where, you know, every day you're good to me, but just one day you're just kind of off with me, then I'll keep my distance. I'll let you cool off. And then, you know, I'll come back and, and be that kindness. And so again, consistency is you know bringing that level of energy almost every day and yeah some days you might feel tired some days you might feel exhausted some days you might feel irritable but at the end of it all it's the majority of the time you're going to show love and you're going to show kindness and that's what really builds you up and builds up the people around you so 
Thank you for your time. I hope you enjoyed the video today. And if you're feeling the vibe, please click on the like, share, and subscribe. Share that love.